What's up, everybody? This is Carl from Tech Book Goodies, and today we are looking at Uni USB-C 8-in-1 USB-C Hub. Now, one of the reasons that I wanted to take a look at this was specifically because I've had other hubs in the past that when I put into my travel bag or take along with me, I feel like they are just going to break, and I've had some break in the past, and this one looks like to be a fairly rugged USB-C hub, along with the other features that I specifically wanted to test out. So let's go ahead and take a look at what is in the box here. So in the box itself, you have the hub. And like I said, one of the things that I liked about this specifically is that it has this rubber coating on the outside that gives it a little bit of extra durability when you're using it or when you're bringing it in your bag. And when you put it onto the desk, it's not going to slide around as easy as some of the other hubs. I have a hard time keeping them in the location I want to on my desk, and that little bit of grip will definitely help out. You also get a USB-C to USB-C cable, so this is your primary cable for hooking up to whatever device you want, whether it's Windows, Mac, iOS, like an iPad, like my new iPad that I just got, Chromebook, all of those are supported by this hub, so you're able to sort of switch between devices if you need to. If we take a close look at the device itself, on the side here, you'll see that you have an, a normal SD card reader and you have a micro SD card reader. For me, that's super important because I do a lot of filming on different cameras using SD cards, and I wanna be able to take this and quickly transfer the data from the card to my computer. And that's possible, obviously, because it is a USB-C device. This cable is capable of up to five gigabit per second transfer, so moving those large video files from here to my computer or to my iPad is gonna be very quick. In addition, on the side here, you have two USB-A 3.0 ports that you can hook either a flash drive, a mouse, a keyboard, anything that you want to be able to hook up through that, you can. So for example, if you have a computer that doesn't have enough USB ports and you wanna hook up a, a wired mouse or a wired keyboard, you can do so, or you can put a flash drive in there to be able to move things around. On the reverse side, you have a power delivery USB-C port. This is not a full featured USB-C port, so you're not gonna get video out of this, but you will get up to 100 watts of charging power through this, so if you have this connected to your only USB-C port on your computer, this will pass through power so you can charge your computer or your device while using the hub itself. In addition, you have a HDMI port on the side, so this is a 4K HDMI port. One of the things that I want to be able to do is hook my iPad up to my 4K TV downstairs and use something like Steam Remote Play or Xbox Game Pass or something like that. If you're gonna use HDMI in 4K, you need to make sure that you have an HDMI cable that supports that higher resolution, but this hub will support that. In addition, you have hardwired ethernet. If you like to hook your devices directly up to ethernet to get that higher speed, this does have a one gigabyte per second ethernet port that you can use. And in addition, on this side, it's good to know that you have another USB-A port, but it is a USB 2.0 port. So for example, let's say you have a Logitech keyboard and mouse that has one of the 2.4 dongles, you can plug that in right there and you're not wasting your higher speed USB ports on the other side. And there are a lot of different USB-C hubs out there, but I think what's important is finding the one that works for your particular need. That's why I've looked at a couple on my channel because each one seems to have some sort of different feature that might appeal to you based on how you use your computer. Again, to go over a couple of the features here, just to make sure that you have a sort of list of everything that this does offer. Ethernet up to 1000 megabits per second, so one gigabit per second. You have the HDMI up to 4K 30 hertz coming off the back side here, but you can also do 2K 1440p or 1080p at 60 hertz, so that's important to know does have the SD card readers, which I'm definitely gonna take advantage of. It supports the higher speed SD cards, so you will get that full speed transfer off of here. Two USB 3.0 ports, one USB 2.0 port, and the USB-C 100 watt charging. Now, again, that 100 watts is huge because a lot of laptops these days take that higher power charger to be able to charge sort of your devices faster, and this pass-through will allow you to do that. So I hope that helped if you are in the market for a USB-C hub. Honestly, like I said, there are a lot of them out there and it is up to you to figure out which one will work for whatever situation you're in. 
Uh, but this one is a very well built, a very nice USB-C hub that I think we should take a look at. If this did help you out, give me a thumbs up, give me a like, subscribe. I'd love to see you back. But until next time, this is Carl from Techful Goodies and I'm out.